The next example, ladies and gentlemen, what I said is going to be so, so important for you guys to make sure you have to understand is going to be vertical angles. And vertical angles are going to have when we have two angles that are formed by intersecting, intersecting lines. And then also, that's a period, vertical angles are equal in measure. Huh. Equal in measure. So now I have, an I have two examples up there that we need to determine. Are they an example or a non-example? So one just thing, guys, if you're thinking about vertical angles, the best way I describe it is seriously take two lines, cross them, intersect them, and you create vertical angles. Now, we have one, two, three, four, right? When I intersect lines, I just created four angles. Yes? Did everybody see that? I just took two lines, and I intersected them, and now I just created four angles. But when I'm talking about vertical angles, I'm only talking about two angles. All right? I'm only going to be talking about two angles. And those two angles, remember, have to be equal in measure. Have to be equal in measure. Yes. So if you were looking at 1, 2, 3, and 4, what angles would you say probably look like they're kind of similar to each other? Probably have the same angle. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why would you say 1 and 3? Because they're both acute. They're both And what would you say about 4 and 2? They both have twos. Both have twos. Yeah, very good. So guess what, ladies and gentlemen? The measure, or you can just say, well, yeah, measure of angle 4 is equal to the measure of angle 2. Measure of angle 1 is equal to the measure of angle 3. So if you guys take, if you guys take angles and you cross them, what, do you want, what I want you to understand is vertical angles are across from each other from the vertex. They are non-adjacent sides. And which I didn't write that. Why did I not write that? Two angles that are formed by the intersecting lines. Vertical angles, I'm sorry, I forgot to mention another point. Share a vertex and do not share any sides. Any sides. So my apologies, I forgot to add, I forgot to add that in when you guys wrote that down. So Elena, when you look at this, do the angles 4 and 2, do they share a vertex? Do the angles 4 and 2 share a vertex? Yes. Do they share any sides? No. Look at angle, angle. The only thing that they have in common is that point, right? That vertex. So therefore, those um, angle 4 and 2, that's an example of vertical angles, all right? So now, let's go and take a look at our examples. You ready? OK. So let's go and take a look at these two examples. All right? When we look at these two examples, I'll just maybe look at angles 1 and 2. Uh, let's use the different numbers. Just do 3 and 4. All right? Are angles 1 and 2, are those angles, first of all, are they created by intersecting lines? Well, they're not lines, but these end up being rays. But they, are they intersected by two, um, two linear forms, by two rays, at least or two lines? Yeah. Yes, they are. Do they share a vertex? Do they share any sides? No. no. So as far as the definition of um, vertical angle, those look pretty good, right? So what we can say is angle 1 is e oh, I'm sorry, angle 1 and Angle 2 are vertical angles. And we know that vertical angles are what? Anybody? What do we know about vertical angles? What do you know about the measures of vertical angles? Always. You're going to have to know this. Uh, always equal to. You, you might as well just say that to yourself 20 times at night, right? You're going to have to know vertical angles are always equal to each other. Um, can anybody tell me why this is not an example? Why does this not work? Please raise your hand. Why does this one not work? Yes. Well, just three and four. Why are three and four not vertical angles? They're across from each other. These are across from each other. Those are across from each other. Why? How do you know? There's no protractor, though. So how can you determine? Yes? You're, on, you're right. You're right. But I, want, I just want something a little bit more concrete. Why are these? There's something in the, I'm sorry. There's something in the definition that I want you to counteract why these are not vertical angles. 
What do I need for it to be vertical angles that this is not showing? They're not intersecting lines. Yes. They're not intersecting lines. You just have like all these different rays going through, right? So from these two points, you guys see that these lines continue down the direction. But here, you just have rays coming off a of vertex. So they're not there's no lines that are intersecting. You have this line, but then this is not a line, right? So they're, therefore, they're not inter they're, therefore, those are not vertical. So we're almost done. Almost, I say. Ha, 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 ha.